hi everyone welcome to js geeks google earth engine tutorial series in today's session i will discuss about earth engine image collection so if you uh, navigate to the google earth engine site you see uh, data sets now click on this data set and after clicking on uh, it will navigate uh, you to the google earth engine data catalog here you can find different types of data sets that are available in google earth engine you can use any of this without any cost so here you see landsat 8 imagery sentinel imagery and high resolution imagery modis uh, modis data and land cover data train data and so on so in this tutorial i will show how you can collect this uh, landsat uh, this this uh, imagery into your google earth engine and how you can use it so in order to use it we need to uh, first navigate to the google earth engine code editor i already navigated uh, uh, from this platform uh, click just click on code editor and it will navigate you to the google earth engine code editor after navigating to code editor uh, here you will see the search option uh, as uh, in this tutorial i show you how we can collect uh, landsat 8 satellite imagery just click uh, just type here in landsat landsat 8 and hit enter it will uh, search uh, the relevant imagery of landsat 8 uh, in uh, available in google earth engine it will take some time after that uh, it, it will show you the list of available image collection uh, for landsat 8 imagery here you will see the search result shows uh, the landsat 8 image collection first one is landsat 8 collection two tire top up atmospheric uh, reflectance uh, here is also available uh, raw landsat satellite imagery uh, surface reflectance and and so many so many options so you can uh, you can explore it uh, for your project or to know more about this so to know more about uh, each of the image collection just select uh, just click on uh, first uh, point out the mouse and click on uh, on any image as collection and it will show you the details of this image collection here uh, first uh, provides the description then provides band here you will find which band uh, is available in this image collection different types of band it resolution wavelength and so on there is also image properties you can you can also uh, you can also check which uh, image properties is available uh, for uh, for each of these images into this collection and in the left side here is the data set availability it shows that this data set available from 2013 uh, 2013 to onward uh, March uh, 2018 March 2013 to onward so now uh, if we want to collect uh, if we want to work on those image collection uh, we just need to import this image uh, into our code editor Art engine provides a default import button if you just click on just click on and it will automatically import in your code editor you see our image collection is already imported into the code editor and by default uh, it takes name uh, a variable name as image collection if you want to change uh, this image collection uh, variable name you can do it just uh, point uh, just uh, point the mouse over this uh, image collection and click it will select it you can change it uh, by typing name just uh, for example i type ic image collection short variable it just uh, it just uh, it just rename the uh, image collection variable you can use this variable for further uh, for, for further uses and if you click on you will show the image collection path the version and bands available list of bands and if you want to delete this image collection you can do it uh, just point over this uh, image collection and in the left side you see there is a delete button just click on this delete button and it will 
and and just click on ok now it's deleted another way we can import this landsat data just again hit type uh, landsat date and hit enter and again uh, navigate to this uh, image collection uh, after that uh, it takes some time uh, after uh, opening this page uh, below the data set available you will see the code snippet uh, from this uh, code snippet option you can easily copy this image collection uh, it's just uh, the uh, it's it's basically uh, the image collection path uh, available in google earth engine uh, it takes time it takes some time please wait just close it and again hit enter yes yeah uh, in the data set available below or uh, below the data set available uh, you see collection snippet just uh, click this icon and it will highlight this and copy this image collection now close this button again close and if you want this uh, input this image collection just type create a variable well, called uh, and I uh, name this variable is IC then equal and then paste it, it just collect this image collection uh, it, it just uh, we, we just collect lens at 8 uh, to earn a t1 top of atmospheric reflectors images in the next say, video i'll show you how we can filter our image collection uh, by date uh, short by cloud cover uh, filter by geometry thank you for watching